Hello friends, welcome to Bank Exams today. Today we are going to do the chapter time and work. First of all, let me discuss discuss with you the history behind this chapter. So this time and work concept is used in cost accounting, basically to determine that how much labor is required to do a particular set of job and to minimize the cost. To do this, these questions we have two methods. The first one is the fraction method. In this method, what we do is we calculate the efficiency, uh, the so-called efficiency, in the terms of ratios. So, if A can do a job in ten days, he can do one tenth of the job per day. There is a second method. We use efficiency in percentages. So, we I call it. Efficiency method. And this is a bad, better and the easier method. So here, if A can do a job in ten days, that means he can do hundred divided by ten, ten percent of the job in one day. By doing the questions by efficiency method. We can sim uh, simplify that how we calculate the every question and minimize the time consumed in each uh, solving each question. So we will discuss in ex uh, examples. So let's see. Okay, let's take another example. If A can do a job in ten days and B can do the same job in five days, in how many days they can complete the job if they work together? So what is the efficiency of A? Efficiency of A is 100 divided by 10 is equal to 10 percent per day. Similarly, what is the efficiency of B? That is 100 divided by 5 is equal to 20 percent per day. What is the combined efficiency? The combined efficiency is 10. 10% plus 20% is equal to 30% per day. So if A and B works together, work together, they can complete 30% of the job in one day. In how many days they will complete the 100% of the job? Simply 100% 100 divided by 30 is equal to 3 to 1 over 3 days. That's the answer. Let's take another example. If A and B can do a job in four days, if they work together, and if A can complete the job in twelve days if he works alone, in how many days B can do the job if he works alone? So, what's the combined efficiency of A and B? It's hundred divided by four. That will be twenty-five percent per day. So what's the efficiency of A alone? It's 100 divided by 12. It comes out to be 8.33%. So what would be the efficiency of B? Efficiency of B would be efficiency of A and B combined minus efficiency of A. So the efficiency of B comes out to be 25% minus 8.33%. So the efficiency of B is 16.66%. So if we need to convert the efficiency in terms of days, we simply do this 100 divided by 16.66. This comes out to be 6 days. So six days is the answer. Let's do another example. If A and B can do a job in eight days and B and C can do the same job in 12 days. If A, B and C, if they work together, they can do the same job in six days. In how many days A and C can complete the job? This is a question from SBI 2010 maybe. So A and B can, what is the efficiency of A 
and B. The efficiency is 100 divided by 8. This comes out to be 12.5%. Similarly, the efficiency of B and C comes out to be 100 divided by 12, comes out to be 8.33%. What is the efficiency of A, B and C and the combined efficiency comes out to be 100 divided by 6 is equal to 16.66%. So what we need to calculate here is the efficiency of A and the efficiency of C. So how would we calculate the efficiency of A? So if we deduct A plus B plus C, A, A plus B from A plus B plus C, we will get the efficiency of C alone. Okay. So first of all, calculate the efficiency of C. The efficiency of C becomes, if we take this equation as third, this one as second, and this one is first. To calculate the efficiency of C, we will de deduct the first equation from third equation. So the efficiency of C comes out to be 16.66% minus 12.5%. So the efficiency of C is 4.16%. So if we need to calculate the efficiency of A, we will deduct B plus C from A plus B plus C, simply 3 minus 2. So it comes out to be 16.66% minus 8.33%, it is 8.33%. So the efficiency of A and C comes out to be 8.33% plus 4.16% this comes out to be 12.5% so the combined efficiency of A and C is 12.5% so in how many days A and C can complete the job we simply we will do what we will do 100 divide by 12.5% percent so it comes out to be eight days in eight days a and c can do complete the job if they work together hope you like this video please subscribe to channel bye